Oh, good evening. If you're just joining us, we're in Bangkok, Thailand. It's the final. Not as fast as some coaches would like. <laughs> Shelly drives in, banks it in. She was impressive. Anoku, who I thought was uh, really good yesterday, but she couldn't get back on the court because everybody else was playing so well. And now the captain, Scanlon, drives in. University of Portland. Oh, University yes. of Portland. Sorry, Port who's going to Portland State? I, I, that's what we have written down, oh, okay, Jeff, okay. But, Oh, yeah. nice drive, and at the finish, it's going to count. And keep in mind, this is an enormous stat. Good job, way to take the contact for Ansi there. The, the Australia, that's why we're seeing her really excel here. Well, Shelly gets it into Anstey, and she scores. I was like, she needs to throw that back out, but you she's know, like, nope. Maybe the uh, medical staff have magic hands. Pass to Van Lith, and she hits another one. Goodness. 16 attempts a game from three so far in this tournament. They're only shooting 30% as well. Boy, Anstey is not afraid of Boston at all. She's going right at her. We Catlett, maybe a little bit too much, but Scanlon there to pick it up. Australia pushing it quickly. They get it again to Fowler. The gyms are off and running. You'll take the shooting woes yesterday. Scanlon this time gets it down low. Anstey again with the rebound and put back. She's playing like a center possessed tonight. <laughs> Queen Ekbo. Oh, boy, that was quality. You know what, this might be a moment for Australia, one of the guards or someone to pick up a foul. And Beckers. That, that happens, you pick up a foul so you can get in. Playing for one of the best basketball players, one of the top coaches. And best players of all time. Yeah. Don Staley, Staley. what a turn from Bourne. Not backing down, they're not intimidated. They believe that they can score. Howard for three. That's right where she hit that crucial three last night. Potter this time turns it over. Howard almost turned it over as well. She's able to control it. Now she's open. She puts it up and she ties it. You just, you can't leave her open. I mean, right there, Potter kind of flew backwards on her. Clark for three. Ball bounces long. Great effort by Taylor. What a play. Boston benefits. And those were kind of the effort plays and the who wants it more. Well, I think Australia lost sight of the shot clock, but never mind the game clock. Skip pass over to Imanopu. She gets inside, puts it up, and bites it in. She turned the game in Australia's favor yesterday when she came off the bench. The Duke University uh, star guard. And nice drive again from Imanopu. In the quarterfinals, Imanopu was really yes, kind of stepped up and was, uh, we didn't see a lot of her yesterday. Good hands, but then Boston gets it back. Clark to Boston again, using her good, her body to good effect. Good child in the lane. Imanoku open, so she's gonna take it. And there is good child for the offensive rebound and put back. And now Imanoku, who has been terrific on the break, hands it off to Scanlon. Australia beat USA down the floor. The turnover to Howard. Becker's open floor pulls up. Oh boy. Fowler got it to Goodchild, maybe a little bit too late. And USA come away with possession. All the bodies down. Here's Becker's again. She'll maybe pull up. No, she's going to fly in for the layup. USA back in front. Already her bag of trips offensively are incredibly impressive. Fowler turns and scores. That's her best move that I've seen over the last two days. That kind of a combination between a hook shot and a little one-handed jump shot. Beckers! That's another part of her arsenal there. Bounce pass inside and really born was surrounded. Beckers again. This is where she's so dangerous. This time she passes it off to Naz Hillman. But if Australia wanted to press. Here's Shelly, and yeah, nice little uh, runner there for her. Quick pass down low to Bourne, and she gets rejected by Howard. Pulled up for a three. Uh, they should have held on to the ball and ran on offense. Oh, she takes it early and makes another one. It's the second time late in the quarter. They've taken a three. Most outstanding player in that first half, guarding Howard. Now Beckers puts it on the deck and goes to the basket and scores immediately. 
Now Van Lith. Beckers pulls up and hits it. You know, statistically, the stuff that Emma Noku does, I don't think really shows up. Shelly for three. Good defense. job defensively, yeah. By Great defense. Shelly. And now Goodchild in the open floor. She's got three on one. She gets it off. Fowler lays it up and in. They've been taking, you know, uh, I like they're not. Oh. oh, Becker's in for the layup. And USA have tied it up at 47. Has to throw it over Howard. Now Taylor open, feet set. Oh, boy, she has been tough coming off the bench. She has to be on the floor in crunch time. Yeah, exactly. Believe it. Gets it to Boston. Boy, look at Taylor get in there and rebound it. Anstey swatted it. Well, they want to get good shot. Look at Van Lith just take it away from Shelly. She's going to race in and lay it up for a four-point lead. Heel again for three. She has just got big game quality, doesn't she? Beckers to Boston. Nice idea. And the foul. Shelly, good pass to Anstey, who waited and scored. She has been what outstanding. Best player in the court. <laughs> I mean, the way she got down on the fast break. Now Shelly penetrates, drives, scores. And Australia back in front. Belibi holds on to it, ends up knocking it out of her hands, but Hillman's there to pick up the ball and put it in. And Taylor pulls up in the lane. He gets blocked by Anstey. Oh. And as she hurt herself. She wants to run it off, obviously, clearly. Coaches are going to give her an opportunity to run it off. Well, Imanoku for three. Go! Australia have gone back in front by three. On the foot of Taylor. On the block by Imanoku. And what, what a play by Boston. By Boston just Gosh. With it. Second easy putback Imanoku has missed in this game, Jeff. In the second half. Up to Beckers, and now Hillman blocked by Bourne. Two consecutive trips down the floor, and Bourne has been terrific. Shelly. Boy, you feel the fatigue, don't you? Look at Shelly spinning. I was just about to say, no, Shelly, don't, don't take the kind of shots you were taking in the third quarter, but. Three-pointer from Van Lith. Fowler holds on to it. Bounce pass in the no poo. Wow! And now Anstey has it. And Anstey, oh! She caught Howard big time. And it was. They're I gonna, actually they're gonna think talk the ref changed it. his call. Yeah. I, I think it was a foul on it, Howard. It was. And then an offensive yeah. foul. Yeah, and this is what they're so talking about. But can't they go to video replay here? I don't. Well, they're gonna they're gonna tent. No, they can't. Oh. A memorable play. Oh, they're gonna throw it over the defense. Van Lith catches it. Oh, what a play! She scores it to tie it. Well wow, what executed. What a play! Going into overtime. Here you have the highlight. That was the two points by Van Lith to tie the game. Percent from the free throw line, which is it's not a great stat, Jeff. Oh, Beckers. Lost it, got it back, but didn't score. But Hillman gets it, puts it up, and it's fouled. Beckers looks the inbounds. Oh, she got it to Van Lith, who was open. She passes it up and goes in and hits the short jumper. The two. USA looking a little bit better right now. And in my opinion, Anstey looks gassed. And Howard, the mid-range jumper. Good effort by uh, Anstey to keep it alive and bat it into the hands of Fowler. Anstey gets it to Fowler. She goes up and scores, gets it back to two points. Right now, you need a stop. You got to get a stop and a rebound. USA Basket, they might put it away. No, Howard short, but the offensive rebound. She was trying to protect the ball. Her elbow made contact to Howard's face. Wow, they're tired. Howard misses both. Anstey rebounds it. And the USA celebrate. Deservedly, they were outstanding.